Hey guys, John here. Welcome to Knife Making Tuesdays Week 8. Uh, this will be a short video. I just, uh, I spent the whole day on the computer redesigning the knife pretty much. Uh, every little thing that bugged me about the first one, uh, redesigned it and made it better all around. So I'm going to just real quick walk you through the changes. Um, starting with the obvious one, I made the handles quite a bit thinner. They used to be 0.18 inches and now they are uh, 0.12 so quite a bit thinner <clears throat> lets me use eighth inch titanium stock much easier and uh, another thing is I contoured the front area of the knife here uh, it's something a lot of the higher end knives seem to have and it looks really nice um, you know and it sort of flows the blade into the or the handles into the blade which is really nice um, and I contoured this little area coming into the um, thumb stud, sort of like a hinderer does, uh, because I noticed it's it's awkward to get your finger into the thumb stud to open it. So I contoured this, and uh, that should uh, make it super nice. Did that on both sides because the clip or the thumb stud will be reversible. Um, the obvious thing, I made it a flipper. Uh, I didn't think I could pull it off with this design, but uh, lo and behold, I did. Uh, so let's flip it open by closing that and opening that. Boom. Uh, the blade shape profile is pretty much the same. Uh, let's hide this handle and we can see where the flipper is. Uh, it's a little thin right here, but it's, I mean, it's eighth inch, eighth inch steel, hardened steel. There's no way that's ever going to break. Um, and I got the button lock to, in theory, work properly. I added a stop pin up here in the corner. And that's the gist of it, really. Oh, and I, I changed to a smaller diameter pivot and uh, ball bearings instead of those uh, roller bearings. I, I found that these were a lot smoother uh, in, in my testing than the roller bearings because they have less surface area because they're balls. Um, so a little bit smaller pivot. This is the same exact pivot that uh, Les George uses on his VECP knife. Uh, so wonderful pivot design, uh, wonderful bearings, and my blade's moving all over the place. That's fun. Um, <laughs> and the clip and everything. That's funny. So that is that. Um, obviously I'm missing a mate here so that they don't stay together. That's okay. So, next week, hopefully I can spend the week, uh, the day coding and start cutting out the new, the prototype part two. And, um, make it a flipper. Anyway, guys, as always, thanks for watching. And, uh, post a comment if you have anything good to say. If you have anything bad to say, I don't really want to hear it. <laughs> but uh, thanks again, guys. Take care. Bye.